One of the greatest things about my job at Fortune is getting an up-close look at leaders, and over the years, getting to know some of those leaders pretty well. Leaders of all kinds, across industries, from every type of background, different in so many ways, but I've also been able to see what they have in common, what distinguishes the truly great ones from the rest. I've learned from them all. After Russia invaded Ukraine, the CEO of McDonald's, Chris Kamchinsky, told me how he made the wrenching decision to pull out of Russia completely, though he had 62,000 direct employees there. It's actually a good framework for many of us making decisions. I've known Doug McMillan, CEO of Walmart, for many years, going back long before he was CEO, how he got there and then established himself as the company's youngest CEO since Mr. Sam is a model. General Motors CEO Mary Barra got the job just days before a major crisis hit. She handled it by throwing out the GM playbook and has since changed the company's culture, which many predecessors had tried and failed to do. I have personal stories about all these and many more of today's leaders, plus some of the greats of the recent past, Bill Gates, Richard Branson, Ted Turner. Some of the stories are serious, a few others are tragic, many others are funny. They all offer insights into what great leaders do that makes them great. I love telling these stories and I've found that people love hearing them and love learning from them.